welcome to Country Music Minute. We are sitting down today with Rochelle Lene, who is heating up the country charts with her whole lot of nothing. Hi. Hello. How are you? I'm doing great. How are you? Good. Before we talk about your latest single, I want to ask you, you grew up in Alaska. How has that influenced your music? Well, I think you're always influenced by wherever you come from. Um, but, you know, part of it is the small town thing. But Alaska, um, I think, was, it was a really big influence creatively. You know, if, if you're surrounded by that kind of beauty and just wildness, <laughs> you know, it, it influences you to be more creative. And for me, that took the form of songwriting. So that's kind of where it all started. <laughs> yeah, and, and you went to school here in Nashville at Belmont. And you've opened up for acts like the band Perry, Maddie and Tay, um, Randy Hauser. What was that experience like for you? You know, the cool thing about opening up is for other acts is that you get to kind of stand back and like watch their set and you get to see what they're doing and, and like, oh, that's interesting. Maybe I'll incorporate that, you know? Yeah. And you get to kind of learn and hang out. And a lot of those acts that you mentioned, I mean, great experiences just just hanging with those people like mm -hmm. you know and it's it's a family in country music so it's it's always fun when you can be out on the road together yeah so have is there any sort of ritual you do before you go on stage or yeah well the one thing we always do is I my entire band will circle up hold hands and pray um, pray that we rock and and that it's awesome and that we bring God the glory so that's the that's the one thing we always do um, I also always am kind of kicking around before, <laughs> like I'll be like doing like big high kicks and and you know swinging my arms around. It looks really hilarious. But <laughs> before I go up on stage, um, just to kind of loosen up and get ready for whatever I feel inspired to do in the moment. So. Yeah. Have you ever had anything crazy happen on stage? Probably. Ah, <laughs> uh, gosh, I'd have to keep. We can we can come that. back to that one. So you are set to play this year at the CMA Fest, which yeah. is on. I think you said you play June 11th at yeah, 11. Thursday. Yeah. Thursday. Okay, the opening day, right? Yes. At the AT and T Country Country Deep stage. Yes. Okay. Uh, so I think it's pretty early. It's like 11:15. 11:15. So. You guys heard that. So if you were here in Nashville, be sure to wake up early on Thursday and go catch her at the AT and T yeah. stage. Yes. Yeah, so I want to talk to you about your latest single, "A Whole Lot of Nothing." You filmed this. Um, well, I don't know if you filmed this, but parts of it were in Hawaii on an yes. island in Hawaii. Did you yes. actually? get to go there and film it or was it a green screen let us let us in on behind <laughs> no, the scenes there was no green screen there was if you look too closely you might see the um moisture <laughs> on my skin no it was it was funny because that shoot was like the hottest and coldest shoot that i've ever done because we did part of it in nashville when it was still like winter weather so we're yeah. like freezing in this warehouse with like all the bright colors that you see in it um pretending to be warm you know and then the other half was Part that you're talking about um, on the island of Kauai mm -hmm. and it was just like so warm and the wind was blowing it was wonderful it oh. was really cool to get to sounds amazing go down there and work you just got done filming in Hawaii and your song is about taking a vacation from life your busy schedule if you could go anywhere in the world where would it be well it's funny that Hawaii honestly honestly I just that place has gotten to be kind of um, a vacation home, like mm -hmm. a place that if I think vacation, I think Kauai. So it's kind of cool to get to, you know, film this vacation song there. But, you know, growing up in Alaska, there's actually a lot of people that, it, you know, it's really dark in the winter, and so there's a lot of people that will go down to Hawaii and vacation to kind of get away from the dark and get there, get a little bit of sun and get ready to go back for the rest, <laughs> of, rest of the winter, you know. And so it just became that place. Now, if I had to go somewhere new, that's a harder that's a harder thing, but I still haven't been to the Bahamas. I haven't so been to the Bahamas either. That's yeah, that's on my list. So, so either one, Hawaii or Bahamas, somewhere yeah, tropical. The beach, the sun, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I was reading on your website, you love to write songs about love. I um, do. So have you ever been in love? I mean, you're super young, so I don't, I don't even know if I should ask this question, but. <laughs> <laughs> um. Yeah, I have. Yeah. Yeah, it's it's love nice. is love is a crazy thing, right? It is. Well, and that's, that's why it's such a focal point of so many songs, and that's why mm -hmm. it like there's only so many stories to be told, and they've all been told, but we still all want to hear about it. We still all want to sing about it because it's such a powerful thing, and we have all experienced something about mm -hmm. it. You know, if you haven't been in love, you're like 
where is my this love of my life that everyone's talking yeah. about? Um, if you have been, then it's either been this amazing, awesome experience or this terrible, wretched heart rate heartbreak uh -huh. you know and or maybe both yeah. um, but but you know it's just such a powerful thing that connects to everybody so uh, on your last album you you wrote a lot of songs you've co-produced you kind of like to do everything yeah. as a new musician yourself a new artist what would you say it takes to be a well-rounded musician I think one of the cool things about being a musician is that your life isn't really the same ever so um, you know, one day you're writing a song, one day you're recording a song, one day you're on a stage singing it, you know, um, and, and it just continues on that way. And I think that if you want to stay well-rounded, then when you have that, not that you really have much downtime per se, but when you have the time that you're in town that you focus on, you know, for me as a songwriter, I focus on songwriting and, you know, practicing my instruments and keeping those things up and just kind of making sure that you're not neglecting any part of the art. Mm -hmm kind of a balance between everything. You gotta somehow find time to keep it all together. There aren't enough hours in the day, I'm finding, but there's a lot of coffee involved and that helps. <laughs> yeah, coffee always helps. Well, you have this like country book, but you are very like rock and roll too. Can you tell fans where are some of your favorite places to shop? Because I love what you're wearing right now. It's super cute. Thank you, thanks. Yeah, there's, um, gosh, there's a full connect range of things. There's there's some cool places here in Nashville that you don't necessarily have other places. Um, Gary Allen has a place called The Label uh, and it has some crazy stuff for artists, but it's just here in Nashville. Um, as far as bigger uh, chains that more people might be able to go to, you know, Free People is a really big one for me because they have that like hippie rock and roll thing going yeah. on and that's right up my alley. It's so funny because I feel like, you know, fans are in it for the music, but nowadays it's like people go to these festivals and it's like all about the fashion now. So I'm yeah. just kind of curious, you know, what it's you're... It's like all the shopping. It is. You can't get away without buying <laughs> yes. something. Yeah. Shop for the festival. Yeah. Well, Rochelle, it was very nice to have you on today. Thank you so much. You guys go check out her latest single, A Whole Lot of Nothing, and be sure to go to CMA Fest. I'm Rochelle Lene on Country Music Minute. Up next, my brand new video for a whole lot of nothing. I ain't just gonna wait, wait around in a town that's just gonna wait, weigh me down. Friday, I can't shake this headache. Been wearing these heels for five days and jumping on command. I just wanna watch the sun drop, sipping on a lemon drop, kicking off my flip flops. Name writing in the sand Can't you see it? Ooh, don't you want to feel it too? It could be me and you Baby, don't you want to go? I ain't just gonna wait, wait around in a town That's just gonna wait, wait me down Got real big plans And not do anything I just can't Do.